In the competitive world of winemaking, South Africa's first black female winemaker is working hard to make a name for herself. VOA's Caroline Turner has the story. For centuries, the wine industry was controlled by whites in South Africa. But since apartheid ended in the early 1990s, black winemakers have entered the field, including black female winemakers who stand out as rather unique in the profession. Nitsiki Bayela at Stella Kaya Winery in Stellenbosch is South Africa's first black female winemaker. She was recruited to study viticulture and enology at the University of Stellenbosch and was awarded a full scholarship by South African Airways. Like any other job, um, winemaking is all about loving what you do. It's all about the passion. It's all about the understanding and the excitement around all the whole season of harvesting blending, bottling, looking at the product, talking to the people at the end of the day um, when they taste the wine that we've made. In 2009, Bayella won the Woman Winemaker of the Year Award and has won numerous other awards for her wines. It is rare for a woman to compete against white males who dominate the industry. Bayella's goal is to create her own wine brand with her technique and sell it into high-end markets. Her dream is being supported by grape planter Lorna Hughes. It's a tough industry to be in. There, there are many other uh, winemakers or uh, budding winemakers coming out. Not enough jobs, uh, but you know, if you're talented and you um, and you work hard, you know, you can you can do anything. Stella Kaya is a privately owned boutique wine producer situated in the heart of the fertile green valleys of the Cape Winelands, producing and exporting 6,000 cases of wine a year. Carolyn Turner, VOA News.